So now I can basically create multiple API managers and now a mock-up of the API manager will help us test the application. Yes. For example, now instead of accessing the shared instance directly, we can now set a dependency here. We can say API. This has a default value of shared. Now, here we use the instance one, not the global one. Use the instance property to call get users. So in the test side now, we can subclass, let's say, uh, API manager stub that subclasses API manager. And when you call get users, it does nothing. Mm -hmm. For example, it does nothing. So here, when you create the SUT, and say SUT.API equals API manager stub. Now, when we call load the view if needed, it will trigger the view did load cycle, but it will not perform requests because yep. this method does nothing. Exactly. So what is wrong here? Just need a private. Does need a is an initializer. Yeah. Override. Boom. Okay. Okay. So now we are using a stub rather than a real require real implementation that will actually perform a request. Mm -hmm. Right, so this is one way. And now we're using dependency injection. Yeah. Because instead of accessing the shared instance directly, we are actually defining a dependency here explicitly that, hey, I need an API to work. I have a default value, but you can pass another one as well. 